Could Apophis collide with Earth? A new study has presented a surprising perspective on asteroid Apophis, suggesting that while it's currently on a safe path, a minor collision with another space object could potentially shift it onto a dangerous trajectory toward Earth. This is significant because Apophis will come extremely close to Earth in 2029, just 20,000 miles away, closer than some satellites. Earlier calculations ruled out any impact in 2029, 2036, or 2068. But this new insight highlights the unpredictable nature of space and the need for continuous monitoring. In this video, we'll explore the recent study's findings on Apophis, what the 2029 flyby could teach us, and how this affects our planetary defense strategies for the future. A recent study led by Canadian astronomer Paul Wiegert has introduced a thought-provoking scenario regarding asteroid Apophis. While its orbit is currently considered safe for at least the next century, Wiegert's research suggests that even a small collision with another space object, such as a minor asteroid or space debris, could alter Apophis's path. This could potentially send it on a dangerous trajectory toward Earth. Using computer simulations, Wiegert's team examined the likelihood of such an event occurring before Apophis's close flyby in 2029. They found that an object as small as 2 feet .6 meters, could shift Apophis's path enough to bring it into a keyhole trajectory, a specific gravitational path that could lead to an impact in the future. Though the odds are extremely low, estimated at less than 1 in 2 billion, for an impact in 2029, and less than one in a million for a delayed impact, this research emphasizes the unpredictable nature of space. Minor nudges from collisions could have significant consequences, highlighting the need to monitor not only large near-Earth objects, NEOs, like Apophis, but also smaller objects that could indirectly become threats. Agencies like NASA's Planetary Defense Coordination Office use a mix of radar, optical telescopes, and space-based observatories to track these objects with high accuracy and mitigate potential risks. This study underscores the necessity of continuous advancements in planetary defense. For example, NASA's Double Asteroid Redirection Test DART mission successfully altered an asteroid's course by crashing a spacecraft into it, demonstrating proactive strategies to protect Earth. Such efforts are vital for understanding the complexities of asteroid dynamics and developing effective methods to prevent potential impacts, even if they seem improbable today. By considering all possible scenarios, including unlikely but possible events like those suggested in Wiegert's study, we can better prepare for any asteroid threats that might arise. Since its discovery in 2004, Apophis has been a central focus for scientists due to initial calculations that suggested a possible collision with Earth in 2029. At approximately 1,100 feet 340 meters in diameter, Apophis was classified as one of the most hazardous asteroids due to its potential to cause regional devastation. It was given a level 4 on the Torino Impact Hazard Scale, the highest rating assigned to any asteroid at the time by NASA. As more data became available, astronomers refined Apophis's projected path using advanced radar and ground-based telescopes, ultimately ruling out any risk of impact in 2029, 2036, and 2068. However, the close flyby on April 13, 2029, remains a significant event. Apophis will pass within 20,000 miles, 32,000 kilometers of Earth, closer than some of our geostationary satellites. This unprecedented proximity will allow observers in parts of Europe, Africa, and Asia to see it streak across the sky. The event provides a rare scientific opportunity to study an asteroid of this size up close and gather valuable data on enneodynamics. This flyby offers a unique chance to observe how Apophis interacts with Earth's gravitational pull which could slightly alter its orbit and rotation. These observations are critical for refining models that predict the trajectories of other potentially hazardous asteroids. PHAS 
Such data is vital for improving impact predictions and developing strategies to mitigate risks from future asteroid threats. The Close Encounter serves as a real-world test of our planetary defense capabilities and our understanding of asteroid behavior in near-Earth space. From May 2021 until 2027, Apophis will remain positioned in the daytime sky, making it nearly impossible to observe with ground-based telescopes. When it reappears in the night sky, astronomers will have a limited opportunity to gather critical data to confirm its orbit and physical characteristics, ensuring no unexpected changes have occurred that could alter its future path. This verification is essential for maintaining confidence in our current models and ensuring Apophis remains on a safe trajectory. The 2029 flyby will allow for more precise observations. As Apophis passes so closely, Earth's gravity could induce asteroid quakes, seismic vibrations that reveal information about the asteroid's internal structure. Understanding these effects is vital for improving our impact mitigation strategies. Ground-based radar, optical, and potentially spacecraft observations will be essential to capture detailed data on Apophis's shape, surface features, and spin state. This information will refine our models of NEO dynamics and impact prediction, providing a better foundation for future planetary defense. To expand on this, NASA and ESA are planning a mission called OSIRIS APEX to study Apophis after its 2029 flyby. Building on the OSIRIS-REx mission's success in returning samples from asteroid Bennu, OSIRIS APEX will focus on examining Apophis's surface composition, internal structure, and response to Earth's gravitational forces. The data collected will help develop more effective planetary defense strategies, such as using kinetic impactors or gravity tractors to change an asteroid's path. Observing how Apophis behaves during its close encounter will help scientists test these methods and enhance preparedness for any future threats. For further context, Apophis is not the only asteroid of concern. Asteroid 1950 DA, for instance, has a small probability of impacting Earth in the distant future. Studying multiple NEOs like Apophis and 1950 Zero DA allows scientists to compare their trajectories, behaviors, and responses to gravitational forces, deepening our understanding of how to manage and potentially redirect hazardous asteroids. Long-term monitoring of Apophis and other potentially hazardous asteroids, such as 1950 DA, remains essential. Each close approach offers new opportunities for observation and study helping scientists detect any changes in the asteroid's orbits or behaviors over time. This ongoing data collection is vital for ensuring we are prepared for any unexpected developments. As we refine our planetary defense strategies through these studies, international collaboration and technological innovation will be key to building a robust defense system against potential asteroid impacts, ensuring a safer future for Earth. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more cosmic content. Keep looking up, and we'll see you in the next one.